This video is intended to show you how to set up a compression test using the XYPlot software. In the control tab menu under the setup view tab, we want to change our segment A into load control with our load in pounds per minute, set to 30. This will have to be calculated based off the PSI uh, rate you want to go at. Our end channel is the load we want to stop at. And again, this load will be calculated based off the PSI we wanted to reach. Segment B is basically the holding segment, where we want to hold that uh, load for a certain period of time. For this, we set the load, the control channel to load, the control rate to zero, and then the end amount to be time with the end limit being 45 seconds. So basically in this test we'll run at 30 pounds per minute up to a load of 60 pounds and then in which it will go to segment B and hold that load of 60 pounds for 45 seconds. Direction of test will be compression. Our post test will be set to home. So when the test is completed it will return to its home position contact force of the preload will be set to 0.2 pounds and that the rate at which it reaches that 0.2 pounds will be 0.05 inches per minute. Once we've completed up our settings we'll right click upload to indicator and that will begin our test. Once our test is completed we'll get a test report transferred over from the controller and then automatically our test data view tab will pop up with the graph. Now our test data view tab is come up, showing the graph of the test. On the right hand side you'll see this statistical analysis that were set up with the maximum load and the maximum stress results. You can export this data you can export this data to a CSV file, comma separated values, or a JPEG. This concludes how running how to set up a compression test using the XY plot software.